Hey guys, and welcome to Pro Wrestling Unlimited. We all know what's happened to Brock Lesnar in the UFC. He's failed two drug tests, one before the UFC 200 fight, and one the day of the UFC 200 fight. We've heard all the news on how WWE isn't going to do anything about it. They're not going to suspend him. They're not going to fine him. They're not going to be pretty much, there's not going to be any repercussions on the WWE side, and we now know a little more of why. According to this week's edition of the Wrestling Observer Newsletter, Dave Meltzer writes that in Brock Lesnar's actual WWE contract, it states that he cannot be suspended at all by the company. Meltzer also writes that he found out that part-time wrestlers in the WWE are exempt from the wellness policy and they don't have to be tested. So essentially Brock Lesnar has never been tested for anything while being in the WWE on his, you know, the second run after he left the UFC the first time. And since he's considered a part-timer, there you go. He doesn't have to be tested. He could be on all kinds of things. He can be on everything he wants, but WWE will never know. And to be honest, it's like they don't even care. I'm hearing there are a lot of superstars angry about this because, you know, they can get popped for anything, get suspended for 30 days if it's their first offense, and not get paid or this or that. But Brock Lesnar can go take anything he wants, will never get popped because he'll never get tested, and essentially it's going to make the WWE look bad. Most are thinking that they're just going to wait to get through SummerSlam and the scheduled Brock Lesnar Randy Orton match and then maybe take their take a you know different road on this following SummerSlam. Maybe try to do something with Lesnar, try to change some things up. But as of right now, per Brock Lesnar's actual contract in the WWE, he does not get tested for anything as far as the wellness policy and the WWE cannot suspend him at all so like i said that looks bad on the wwe and with many people now knowing this story it looks like okay say shaq wants to wrestle big show at mania next year shaq can come in all steroided up and wwe can't say anything wwe will not test him so they can assume but they'll never officially know so lesnar i guess is okay he's fine the only way they were able to punish him was not take him first in the draft and that's about it. If any more news does come up on Brock Lesnar and his odd stipulation in his contract and the weird exemption on this wellness policy, we will bring it to you here on Pro Wrestling Unlimited. Remember, guys, comment below, like, and share this video, like us on Facebook, and subscribe here on YouTube.